In this tutorial, we will discuss how to create, modify, and delete a CNAME record using the DNS Made Easy control panel. A CNAME record, often referred to as a canonical name record, or alias record, is a type of resource record in the domain name system, DNS, that specifies that one domain name is an alias of another canonical domain name. This helps in running multiple services, like an FTP server and a web server, each running on different ports, from a single IP address. Each service can have its own entry in the DNS, like ftp.example.com and www.example.com. Network administrators also use CNAMES when running multiple HTTP servers on the same port with different names on the same physical host. The major advantage of using CNAME records is that if you change the IP address of your 1A record, any CNAME records that are pointing to that host are also changed. Please note, if you utilize CNAME records, you cannot have any other records of any other type with the same name. Creating, modifying, and deleting CNAME records in DNS Made Easy is a very simple process. The first step is clicking on Manage DNS under the DNS tab in the main menu. If you have recently modified the domain you want to work with, you can easily choose it from the recently updated domains list. If your domain is not listed, you can start entering your domain name in the Manage DNS search box. Once you enter the first few characters of your domain name, a matching list of domain names will appear for you to choose from. Alternatively, you could enter your full domain name and press Enter on your keyboard. In this example, we will be working with the domain example.com. Once your domain is loaded in the control panel, select the Records tab if it is not already active. The Records tab provides an easy-to-view grid layout for all your record types. Your CNAME records will appear as the second grid for your domain. This grid will show your CNAME record listing in a paginated view where you can easily customize how many records you would like to view at a time. To create a CNAME record, click on the plus sign that is associated with the CNAME record type. For this example, we will be creating a CNAME record that aliases ftp.example.com to the root record example.com. Type FTP in the name field. Note, since it is already assumed that you are creating the record for example.com, you do not have to enter the domain name in the name field. You only need to enter FTP. We will leave the alias field blank as we are aliasing to the root record of the domain. Note. In CNAME records, your domain name is automatically appended to your value unless you end it with a dot. In this example, we can just leave the alias field blank and the domain name example.com will automatically be appended to it. Alternatively, you can also enter example.com dot and this would accomplish the same thing. As soon as you click Submit, the record is added to all of the DNS Made Easy name servers worldwide using our proprietary Peregrine Instant DNS technology. If you would like to add additional records at this time, you can do this easily by modifying the appropriate attributes and clicking on Submit. Please note, it is not possible to create a CNAME record for the root or apex record of any domain. This configuration is invalid based on DNS RFCs so you will always need to have a value in the name field for any CNAME record. If we were to create a CNAME record in the example.com domain that aliases to an external domain name, then we would populate the alias field with the value of the host appended by a final dot. For this example, we will create a record that maps imap.example.com to ghs.google.com. In the name field, enter imap. As explained previously, we only need to enter IMAP and not IMAP.example.com. In the alias field, we will enter ghs.google.com dot. Note the trailing dot. If we did not enter the trailing dot, our domain name example.com would be appended to the end of the record. Modifying CNAME records in DNS Made Easy is very simple as well. You can double-click on any of the records and your modification window will immediately appear for you to make any necessary changes. As soon as you click Submit, your record is now updated on all of the DNS Made Easy name servers worldwide. You can then use the navigation on the bottom left-hand side of your modification window to cycle through, review, and edit your other CNAME records. Alternatively, you can select a row that you would like to edit from your CNAME record grid and click on the pencil icon. 
This will also open your modification window where you can make all appropriate changes. Deleting CNAME records in DNS Made Easy is done by selecting the record that you would like deleted and clicking on the trash icon. You can delete one record or multiple records at one time. If you ever need detailed help or examples about the data types that are available for each record type, make sure you click on the Help button that is found on any of your record entry or modification windows. For a full support knowledge base, please visit http colon slash slash support dot DNS made easy dot com. For more tutorials and lessons on using DNS made easy, please visit http colon slash slash help dot DNS made easy dot com.